Hi everyone, this is Mrs Bond and I want to show you today how to find our library catalogue using the school website and then how to use our library catalogue to find websites that are at the right grade level for understanding and reading. So let's start at the school website and we're going to go to the section that's called My IICS. And at the top, we find a link to IICS File at Destiny. That's the name of our library catalogue. When you click that, it'll go straight to the link for the catalogue. When we ask our students to use websites, they need to be logged in. First of all, they have to decide and select the campus that they attend school at. We're going to select the Marmara campus today. And we're going to log in as a student because then we will get to understand the experience that they get. If you forget your username or password at any stage, you can come to the library at either Hussar or Marmara and ask the librarian to help you set one. Here's what the students get when they log in. And they might, for example, be researching a particular animal for class. So we're going to put in dolphin. There are some books available and the catalogue will search first for the library resources. But if the student wants to find websites, they can click on this link, this tab, websites. And it will load them. So here there are 717 websites relating to dolphins. Why are there so few when, if you go to Google, there will be so many? Well, what happens at Follett Destiny is they employ teachers to send them websites that are grade level appropriate and linked with curriculum areas. So the websites that are on Destiny are links to um, resources and websites that academic people and teachers have seen that are useful. The next step that the students can take is they can filter their search by grade level. So for example, if I was teaching a grade 2 class, I would suggest that they go to this grade level. And it reduces the number of websites straight away to 30. But when you um, link on the website, it'll open in a new tab. And you can see that it's actually uh, an appropriate website for students to go to. This one's from National Geographic Kids and it's got some really interesting information. So that's how to use Destiny to filter for websites. It's a really great way for students in uh, elementary school and the primary school area in particular to find age appropriate and reading level appropriate websites. If you have any other questions, please don't hesitate to approach one of the library staff.